Hello everybody, Jason of New Age Revolution Cave. And I wanted to show you a quick update. I wanted to show you a, a bit of a room remodel. That's right, a room remodel. Why did I why did I once again take on the task of remodeling my room? Well, this was a smaller remodel, but it was an important remodel thanks to the Hey Wanna Play Some Nintendo series. Uh, the series has brought me closer to Nintendo. I'm gonna sit down and talk to you. It's brought me closer to Nintendo. Um, it has made me appreciate the collection again. Um, I don't know if I'm going to continue the collection. Uh, I, I lost my list of games I had. I lost the list of games that I still had to go. I, lo I actually left it at a video game convention. I brought This was like four years ago. I brought my list, which was like eight pages, all stapled together. I brought my list of games that I had and games that I needed to this convention, and I left it on a dealer table somewhere. I don't know. And then to go through the task of, you know, doing that again, I, I just, I just haven't. So I don't even know how many games I need. I know I need, I know I have, I, well, I sold some. So I may still have, I probably have less than 400 now. I probably have about 390 NES games. Um, and I don't, I don't need to get more. I, I, I'm fine. So, but it has made me appreciate what I have. And because Liam has been involved with the Nintendo more, it's it's made me appreciate it even more. So I wanted to my Nintendo games were in two different places. They were on they were on two shelves down here, and then they were upstairs in our one of our entertainment cabinets, hidden. And the ones down here were double stacked, so there were games behind games, and that was just to to consume space, condense space, consume not consume. That's that means to take space, uh, condense space. When I did the living room set. And I even at that point was going to sell the Nintendo games because uh, I just I didn't care. Well, I care now. And so I can show you what I did. I moved them to a prime location in the room. Take a look at that. I moved all of my Nintendo games. That is all of them. There are eight games still upstairs. But they're those, um, what's that other company that made, oh, Tengen. It's the Tengen games, the big black carts that don't fit anywhere. I left those upstairs. But there is my new backdrop for the Zenith System 3. That is where the Nintendo games are. They are all single, single stacked, right? I put up a couple of fun little boxes there. And I also redid the TV top. And I like that. So now the TV top is more organized. It's very streamlined, very neat, and I like it. So when I'm hanging out and watching TV, ah, this is what I got. And I even I even can stretch the cord, the controller over to the couch, and I can play Nintendo from the couch. Now I'm a I'm a close to the TV kind of guy when I'm playing Nintendo, so it's it's not that easy from far away. I like to sit right up on top of it. So that cleared cleared out some shelf space, and I put the some of the XOX customs in their own little shelf because I have uh, no more room for LJN figures, as I will show you. But I have now a big blank space right there. What on earth can go there? I don't know. Maybe we'll talk about that in a future episode. But because uh, Four Left's stands are so fantastic, but they they take up space. So I had to I had to condense some of the figures. I put the NWA XOX figures in there. I think that's great. And then I'm going to add another shelf down here for the. Uh, for the black cards once once the stands come in. So we've got one more shelf to go there when when those stands come in. And then I'm going to add another shelf down here. I'm going to have to move this ring somewhere, but I'll have another shelf. So that worked out. Well, where did all the VHS tapes go? Those were behind the TV. Well, of course, I moved them to the VHS closet. And I'll show you what that's looking like. So there's the VHS closet now. 
and that has expanded. I put up another bunch of shelves here. So that has expanded and there's still, again, plenty of room to go if I want to keep the VHS collection going, which I do. And I really like this backdrop. Like if I was to, if I was to do, you know, like movie reviews in here, I could just grab a little chair and position it to where like, let's see, I could probably do it like that. And you would just think I'm in a room full of VHS tapes, which I am. Um, so that, that might be something I do once, once we fill in the VHS tapes here, you know, I could sit in a corner like this and talk movies. So that looks good. I think it's, it's moving along, it's moving up the wall and, uh, yeah, that's pretty good. Now these movies I've been loving all these movies that were free from, from an older man, an older fella who got rid of all his VHS tapes. So all these 1930s movies King Kong, uh, well, Strip Tease, obviously, Strip Tease is a uh, 30s movie that an old man uh, enjoyed, I assume. But we've got, you know, I don't know, we've got so much stuff. Milk Money, no, that's not an old movie. Crime School with Humphrey Bogart, I don't know. So uh, we're going to enjoy all those old movies. So that's what I did with the VHS tapes, and uh, and you saw what I did with the Nintendo games. So that's that. That's the that's the room update. I I like it. I think it's awesome. And I've got a shelf over there. I mean, uh, I got a shelf there. Now what what to do with that shelf? I don't know. In the new year, I thought of possibly collecting another toy line, a smaller toy line. Um, but I don't know what, because I don't know what I care about, and I don't want to get into something with a lot of vehicles. Um, I was thinking about maybe the police academy figures. I was thinking, I don't know. Double Dragon doesn't have a lot of figures. I don't know. I don't know. But I feel like, I feel like I'm ready to collect another toy line. I mean, I still haven't finished Rambo. There are a few more figures for Rambo, but they're extremely expensive. And I don't know if I care enough to get those. So I don't know, maybe there's a smaller toy line out there, you know, eight, 10 figures that I might go after. It, it should be affiliated with a cartoon so that I can care about it. Um, I don't know. I don't know. I don't know. We'll see. So that's that. There's your there's your room remodel. There's your your cool. This is my favorite. This is my favorite spot of the room right here. It just is. It's just. I once I read to the top of the TV, I'm so much happier with the way it looks. So much happier. It, it looks authentically 80s up there. I just like it. So favorite part of the room right there, folks. Uh, the LJN wall is a very close second with those beautiful stands. They just changed the whole look. It's so much cleaner and more streamlined and the figures are front and center and I love it. I think that's it. There you go. There's the room remodel. We'll see you all next time. Good night now.